Hey fam, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jumoke. Nice to meet you. On this channel, we talk about thin to medium, <laughs> fine, natural hair, faith, singleness, dating, dream interpretation. So if any of that interests you, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that bell so that you can continue to get more great content. So now, moving on into our dream interpretation series, into our dreams characters, I want to talk to you briefly, really briefly, about symbols, um, characters as symbols in dreams. So most um, characters in dreams, I would say maybe 80% of the time, they are symbolic. Too many of us take symbols that we see someone in a dream and we think it's literal. You should always, always, always err on the side and assume that this pr person is probably symbolic before you assume that they're literal. If you want to know if it's a literal character, watch the um, previous dream interpretation video. So anyways, um, so people in dreams can represent so many things, especially if they're a people group and they don't even interact with you, then they probably represent um, a symbol. Um, people, let's even your family, your mom and your dad can represent the Holy Spirit, God the Father. Um, your brother and sister can represent like another brother and sister in Christ or something else. The best way to know what a person or a group is symbolizing, what is the first thing that you think of? when you see this person or when you see these group of people. Usually that is where um, the symbol is tied to. It's either that or when it comes to names, sometimes they're homophones. Sometimes they, um, if you see a person in a dream and they have a specific name, look up what that name means. You know, you have to do a little bit of digging sometimes to get what this person could mean. If they're a person that you know, just think about the first um, symbol, not symbol, first meaning that comes to mind. But basically, that's it. Really quick video. Um, this is actually really important, and um, if you take this seriously and apply it, then things will begin to make sense when you see somebody in a dream. But usually, um, they these types of symbols are very personal. They're very subjective. So what is the first thing that you think about and think about how it relates to and correlates to the rest of your dream? So yep, yeah, that's it. Um, <laughs> hope you guys enjoy this video. Let me know what you think in the comment section, and I will see all of you guys later. Bye!